So, I'm dispensing with a microphone today because I don't have time to match my voice with the video and it never comes out perfect anyway because I'm still learning. Anyhow, I just watched a video by Tim Poole where he was talking about this Instagram thought that um, freaked out because she lost her account and now has to go work a McDonald's type job at 9 to 5 and she's just not cut out for it. Of course this was used to segue into a talk about the entitlement of the millennial generation, which annoys the crap out of me because it's just a fruitless discussion where everybody grandstands and feels superior. And here is proof of this. There is another video that Tim pulled a long time ago, well not a long time ago, but, but a while back, where he talked about the van life. And I went into the comments section, and down in the comments section, somebody said Gen Z here, and there was kind of a circle jerk about being Gen Z and being more woke in kind of um, a conservative way. And I'm like, okay. Fantastic, but you're kids. You haven't done anything yet. And this is the kind of identity politics, self congratulatory style this leads to. It doesn't, it's not tough talk that's curing people. It's tough talk that other people assume upon themselves when they feel like they've done just the bare minimum to reach that level above these losers they're talking about. And that's pretty much all I wanted to say. And that's also why I dispense with the microphone, because it's a short, short, sweet point. If you like this video, click the thumbs up button. Subscribe helps me out with the YouTube algorithm, at least I'm assuming, although nowadays you can never know. Visit my website www.fractaljournal.com for essays, articles, opinion, all kinds of stuff. Thanks so much, and take care.